This is the end of friend or foe <laughs> on this channel. We're going to continue posting weekly episodes of the series on SB77+. I've put a full explanation as to why I've done this in the pinned comment of this video. So go subscribe to that channel to continue watching the series. There's some very interesting episodes coming up. Although in this video, I have a very, very good episode, but I have to betray a friend to do it. And also make sure you get your signed friend or foe posters on sp77.store. It's super rare to get a post with four YouTubers that have signed it. Clown literally had to fly from Europe to come and sign them. And there's a limited number, so get them whilst they're still in stock. But yeah, welcome back to friend or foe. We are gaining lives fast. And I have had a change of heart. I was going to help Minnie get the advancement to get an extra life of eating every food. But I've worked out. I'm not that far off. Speak of him, here he is. Hello. Okay, wh where are you taking me? <laughs> yeah, park off, bro. Can I borrow some strength potions and maybe fire res and get your help killing quick? There you go. <laughs> yes. You, 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 look at me. I'm prepared. You need pots. I'm your man. You won't regret this. And... How do you think about a little third party situation? I could get involved. I could get involved and have a little, little dabble. You're after him. You want blood. I, w I want Quiff dead. I, I would yeah. love that. And I do also because he keeps scamming me. Okay, so what's your plan? How are you going to get him? Base PvP. Watch my base. Interesting. So Mini wants me to help him kill Quiff. He's going to lure Quiff to his base for the next time it's PvP. And then he is going to battle him. But I can get involved and do a bit of third party and, and hopefully... I can get rid of him. That sounds like a pretty good situation to me. Anyway, Minnie's on six lives. I'm on five. I reckon I can get I can get this food thing, okay? Like I say, I have got most of them. I've got 21 out of 40. But there's a lot of them that are pretty easy. Like, I do need to eat raw mutton. I need a melon. I need this baked potato. I need an apple. I need the puffer fish. I need the tropical fish. I also need pumpkin pie, which is pretty easy with all the sugar I've got. Cake. I haven't had cake, have I? I need to do that one. Okay, so let's just make the sugar. And then can we just, like, put these together? No. Turns out I need an egg. Okay, didn't think that far ahead. I, I'm going to get rid of these seeds. I don't really. Yeah, need this in my leggings chest. I also know where there's a beehive that has all the honey in for it, so it's just ready to be taken, so I can get that one so easily. A chicken! Oh, lay me an egg. I need you, I need I need this from you, okay? When I come back, there better be an egg in here. Now the beehive is somewhere in here. So basically, Mini needs glow berries in his a mushroom. And he needs wild berries. I know the spruce forest so far away, and it's not easy to get into a lush cave to get the glow berries. So it's gonna take him a while. Plus, he's distracted with Quiff. And here's the hive. Now, uh, the thing is, he's gonna know I'm doing it. Are they angry? Oh, I, I don't, I didn't get an advancement for it. Oh, that's fantastic. I can drink it and continue on the quest. Oh, oh hello. <laughs> I heard a voice there. I was just like, what, what is, what is Quiff, who's Quiff talking to? <laughs> Bro, I'm so confused on what everyone is. Oh, he's over there. That makes things even better. Quiff won't even think that I'm going to be in the vicinity. Right, we're going to eat the raw salmon. I think I need raw pork chops. And it's another chicken. Are you going to lay an egg, chicken? Let's just put you in a hole. There you go. No, don't, don't try and escape. That's it. It's right by Clown's house. It's probably going to annoy him a little bit, but... You know, needs must. Let's see that. The tropical fish and the apple. And yeah, I'm heading to the water because I'm trying to find a shipwreck that has a poisonous potato in it. Oh, look, we've got dolphins as well. Do I have leads on me? Oh, it would be useful. Oh, I need those. Uh, I need those raw cod. If only I had a lead, I could swim so fast. There is a shipwreck there, probably being looted. But who's going to take a poisonous potato from it? I'd say nobody. How on earth are you all the way out there? What on earth? Okay, that's really random. Anyway, it looks like the kind of one that doesn't actually have that chest on it, which is a shame. I'm going to grab some kelp because I do need dried kelp, the tastiest snack ever. Don't want to sail away too far because I need to make sure I'm close enough to help out Minnie and take out Quiff because you know me, I want revenge on Quiff more than anyone after he released Clown from the end. And I have an idea of where I might be able to get potatoes. There is, well, poisonous potatoes anyway. There is a village behind like, not behind my base, but further out. I know where it is. I can go to it. Plus, it's back in this direction, so it'll be really, really convenient. An egg! Oh, you are a great chicken. Is there any in this hole that I put over here? Don't look like it. Just, just blow up a thing with creep as well. Hope clown didn't hear that. Don't look like he's around here though, so I suppose that's a good thing. I'll have to take the poison here. No time like the present. Then the melon and the cod, just to heal up a little bit. And you get so much poison from a puffish. This is actually kind of dangerous. We're at night, and I'm on no health. Um, let's just, let's just wait it out here until I can heal again. I'll make the pumpkin pie as well. That'll be another one. So there's loads of things I can eat. Is it going to run out? Okay, five seconds, finally. I've got just nine to go. I'm trying to stay in the area of Quiff's house, but rabbits are another 
thing that I need to get every food. So I'm just going to keep an eye out for that. I mean, look at all the flowers here. This, you'd think, would be the perfect place for rabbits to live. But instead, you just get chickens. Any eggs? I, I will need one for a cake. Although I'm not entirely sure that a cake is actually part of a balanced diet. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think it is. Which doesn't really make sense, but it's also good. I'm, I'm glad. Are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, the phantoms are out. And rabbits don't actually spawn in plains biomes anymore. So that's why I can't find it. I'm going to probably have to go to a desert, something like that. Who is this? Wait, who's following me? Why is Quiff following me? Quiff, are you are you following me? No, I, I was investigating this uh, courthouse, I and then I, I saw I saw you running, and I'm like, wait, who's that? Okay, well yeah, this is the uh, this is the courthouse. I don't know who built it. I don't well, many built it actually. Um, I don't know who's going to be brought to justice, but. <laughs> Well, we'll I think out. it might be you. <laughs> <laughs> Slightly worried that Quiff is stalking me. Maybe he wants to get me. Which means I should be ready for a battle, shouldn't I? You know, if, if all else... Someone okay. stole Ooh, from hello. me. Someone well... stole my ingredients from a rabbit stew. <laughs> okay, well, I'm just going to straight up say I know you might think I'm suspicious, but I am actually not the culprit, okay? Quiff was over there, but yeah. I promise you what I'm is not... going on, man? Where's my stew? I don't know. Why would anybody steal your stew anyway? I don't know. It's not there, though. I had it all. You know I had it all. I don't Why know you had it all. Well, Quiff was by the courthouse, so that, that could be fitting. Okay, I'm going to go over. This is perfect. Somebody's stolen the ingredients for Minnie's rabbit stew. It wasn't me, so, you know, that's that's good. But that's going to slow him down even more. I could I could actually do this advancement, you know? It's It could happen. I think the big if factor is going to be can... I get a rabbit. Uh, that's, the, that's the thing that's worrying me the most now. But also, can I get a poisonous potato? I think I can get both if I just kind of go full send and travel somewhere. But anyway, here's the village. I think it's been ransacked. I've been here before. Nobody... I didn't ransack it, but all the villagers are, are gone. So I'm guessing it's, it has. But they might have some crops for me. That's kind of what I'm banking on. Although usually when it comes to these places, they just have nothing but wheat <laughs> planted. And I'm like, why? Guys, have you not got a single bit of beetroot or anything like that? And it looks like, once again, I could be... Yeah, I need beet... <gasps> We've got beetroot. Thank, thank goodness for that. Right. Uh, we need we need fortune. Do we have anything with fortune? I have a pickaxe that does. That's going to just get me... I think it'll probably get me more seeds than beetroot. But yeah, it's just going to get me more seeds. I can do some... See, I told you there's someone's been here. I, I could with bone meal. Let's, let's take this with me. Because I know where I can get a load of bones. So I could just bone meal my way through that. PvP's on. Okay, this is the moment that I'm meant to be helping Mini battle Quiff, but I don't know where they are. Okay, me and Mini have worked out we're gonna go and meet at Quiff's house and ambush him. We're hoping he's there and we're hoping we can get him. We're waiting for the right moment. And whilst we wait, I might as well take this moment to get my kelp out of here and start smelting. Now, I think I have bones at home. Or do I? No, maybe I don't. Maybe I use them. I, I, I don't know if Rotten Flesh is on the list, but I'll get it. When I say on the list, I don't know if it's on the list of the ones I need. Or if I'd already done it. I, I'd already done it. And I know this is a bad idea just before a potential fight, but I'm I'm going to eat a spider eye. There we go. Hi. I, I, oh, oof. Anyway, I put my strength in my fire res and we're going in. I feel like he knows. He's running. Not the first time we've been in this situation, ladies and gentlemen. I, I, now, we don't have a tracker, which is the worrying thing. He is running for his life. Man, it's just going to be another waste of a, fi a fire as and a strength, if not. Maybe, though, this is a good way to distract Mini. So that I... Because this is kind of the area I need to be. Although, I left my kelp at my base, which is a bit annoying. Guys, I'm going to get the monsters hunted one. And Endermite is one of them. And I've got it. Maybe he went to Clown's house. Kind of came over in this direction. I didn't know there was a portal in the woods. Yeah, that portal's been there for a while. He just messaged me as, like, he saw us. As we came into view this and saying, I have a deal involving your fish farm. Uh... So he knew you were coming. I, I need to ask a favour. Now yeah. that we've been, had this little bonding experience and we didn't find... Well, Quiff ran away oh, You just us. wasted my time, really, so... I, I I did, I did. And for wasting your time, I want to apologise. Okay. Um, And can I have a wild berry? Because... No. Listen, no. listen, listen! Listen, I'm going to go find the rest. So from what I can tell, Minnie has just got to go and get the glow berries and the sweet berries. This is a worrying time. I, 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 it is a very, very worrying time. He also completely wasted my time on that quiff thing. So, I just need to go out and get rabbits. I'm going to make it so that I have everything I need. And it is just basically me versus Minnie to get an extra life. A normal mushroom stew is another one. So, let me have that. Then there's just beetroot, beetroot stew, the kelp. There's not many at all. I'm going to I'm gonna get this one ready. And I think everything else I can just do on the go. I know exactly where the rabbits are going to be, which makes life even easier. And I am also going to need carrots. I'm pretty sure I used up all my carrots last episode. <gasps> I tried it, boy. Oh. Uh, oh, this is not my looting sword. Where's my looting sword? It'll be in the ender chest. I think at this point I'm the only person that hasn't got a trident, which kind of makes me feel left out. So come on. You're like the third or fourth one of these I've found. And 
Yep, still didn't drop it. Glory of SP737's life on this server. It's going to be very sad. It's going to be a massive waste of time if Mini actually beats me to this. But I, I have kind of left it very late on doing this. I should have had more focus on doing it in the last episode whilst I was traveling. Planned ahead a bit better because I already came across potatoes and carrots. And I could just use bone meal to get those. And, and I wouldn't have to do this. So this is kind of my own fault. Now, we're not too far away from the, the farm over here that gets me loads of bones. Get a couple of stacks of that. I've got six stacks of bone meal. Then with one potato, I can easily get poisonous potatoes. I also need a baked potato for the rabbit stew. That's that's probably a difficult one. I need raw rabbit, cooked rabbit, and rabbit stew. They're like the, the three big ones. So I, I, I don't know. If I go to a desert, I'll get loads of rabbits. There's the farm up ahead. Like I say, it's just the bones. I'm pretty sure I already checked the village for stuff like carrots and potatoes. So I don't think there will be any, but I'll double check anyway. Because, you know, I'd hate to travel miles and miles when it, there was already stuff there. But I'm pretty sure it only has wheat there which is you know it's a bit of a shame but it'll just have to do yeah it's only wheat i'm not gonna tr i'm not gonna you know go around it too much because the reason i know it's only wheat is because i wanted carrots there to breed pigs last episode and it took me ages to find the carrots so i'll grab yeah a couple of stacks of bones you'll see loads oh my goodness this far yeah I, I just kind of wait around here when i'm waiting for people to come on the server like whilst they're preparing i'm just sat here <laughs> and it's uh, it's getting me good stuff and there's a shipwreck right here let's hope poisonous potato if, I tell you, if we get poisonous potatoes early it's gonna be key we do need normal potatoes as well Pretty sure they can be in shipwrecks, and I'm pretty sure carrots can as well. So we're just gonna have to hope for some some of good old-fashioned vegetables. Now this is a shipwreck treasure thing. That's not what I want. Carrots. Let's go. Okay, that's that's good because I needed. Did I need carrots for something? I think the uh, the stew. I needed uh, I needed carrots, didn't I? Yeah, it was. It was the rabbit stew. So that's one less thing to worry about. And now it's just potatoes. And I've just looked it up. Apparently, there's a 40% chance that a shipwreck has a potato in it. So. Uh, we've got a great chance, all right? We just need to keep finding shipwrecks. Uh, there's one over there. And let's see. Oh, yes. Poisonous and normal potatoes. Okay, this is huge, guys. So we'll grab those, sw switch them out. Only one poisonous potato. Take out the feather. Okay, this is very helpful because now I just need rabbits. I've made it to my desert. Don't know if anyone's been in there. The big thing is let's find rabbits. Here we go. There's... I don't think you can run. Oh, no. I need... I need the... I am so sorry that you had to just see that. This one I will get with fire aspect. And I'll be the same for you. I'm going to take some damage from this creeper because I need to get some uh, some health down. Took zero damage. Nice. Right. <laughs> Let's just see. I've, I've got not enough space in my inventory for all this. Let's get rid of some suspicious stew. I need some cobble. This is being looted. It looks like there's still TNT. So I'll break that. I could come in handy, actually. I'll eat the kelp. That's another one down. And also the poisonous potato. Next, I make a furnace. And I don't know what I'm going to fuel it with. I guess I'll, I'll do sticks or something. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I just need to. I just need anything, all right? Anyth and more planks can't be used. So we'll just stick those in there. Raw rabbit eaten. Rabbit stew crafted. With bone meal and the beetroot seeds, I can go ahead and do... I can till the ground. And then I can grow... Oh, no. Wait. You're not going to... Oh, not enough light. Oh, I need a torch. Forget that. I don't need to be down here. Okay, I can go up and do it from the outside. I can be by water. That's fine. Race against time. Because I don't know how long Mini... How, how quick Mini's going to get to where he needs to be. Oh, it's a lush cave here as well. If he, if he went down here, he could get the glowberries. It's actually really annoying that it's night time. <laughs> I need to do this in the day. It's easier. Right, we're just going to kind of make our way over here. Let's till it. Then let's plant these. And foam meal them a bunch. And then we're just going to keep harvesting over and over again until we get... I think we need seven beetroot altogether, okay? PvP's on. Okay, I've got to be a little bit careful. Imagine if somebody ambushed me at a crucial time like now. Anyway, I've got my seven. Let's move that out there. We can eat this. And there's another thing I need. I need raw beef. That's going to be the, the, the last one that's kind of tricky. I need to find a cow. Come on, junk. Ah, the worst place in the world to look for a cow is going to be the jungle. But they do spawn there. A rabbit's foot. Actually, is that is that kind of useful? I feel like it could be useful for something. They're kind of rare to get. I don't need the beetroot seeds anymore. Let's do it. Come on then, cow. Just be on this bit of grass, please. I'm three away, as you can see. And those three are rabbits. Oh, there's a cow here as well. Those three are rabbit stew, raw beef, and a beetroot. Oh, what do I throw away? I don't need all those bones. I don't need the bone meal, more, more importantly. Right, let's... Uh, uh, damage me. That's it. Make me hungry. Oh, you get hunger from these guys as well. It's the perfect thing. Imagine if not being hungry is the thing that costs me. That could be the saddest moment ever, couldn't it? Right, we've got an extra bit of inventory. <gasps> what did I just throw out? Nothing. I, I thought I threw something out by mistake. Okay, that, that did panic me, but it made me hungry, which is, is more important than anything, all right? Oh, I picked up the leather. That's why I, uh, I didn't get enough. Okay. So, wait. We've got this. We're going to beat him. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. Okay, let's eat the raw beef. And here we go. Oh, I feel mean. I feel mean that I'm going to do it before him. I, <laughs> oh, Mini Mook is not going to get it. I, I've got to go for it. If I don't... Oh, I've got to, I'm going to put something in the chat. I'm being mean. He said he's not got the berries. I said I've had a change of heart and I'll give them to you. Let me just double check. This is definitely the last one, isn't it? 
Yes. Oh, wait, it's not. Cooked rabbit has not been eaten. Oh, that could have been awkward. He's not replied to that. I said, accept the offer or shall I just eat them? It's coming home. Okay, see you there. And then... Dun, 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 another life, baby. Look at that. Six lives. I hate you. I hate you. I might have ruined the alliance with Minimigo, but I don't care, all right? I don't care. I need these lives, ladies and gentlemen. I definitely, definitely need these lives. The thing that makes me feel bad is Mini spent about three episodes on it. Oh, there's a jungle, a jungle thing over there. The only reason he couldn't, <laughs> he didn't do it last episode, was because he waited for me to come back and I said I'd give him the berries and I didn't. I've just finessed him. I've absolutely finessed him. I mean, he already had six lives. He didn't need it. We couldn't have him going up to seven lives and me still, still being on five. I needed it more than him. Now then. Can we, we can get armor trims. Yeah, oh, by the way, I forgot to say. <laughs> we're on 1.20 now, so we can get armor trims. Just a, a new thing. And there's going to be new quests that come with 1.20 for extra lives as well. Diamonds and four of them? Wow, that's insane. I think sailing's going to be the quickest way home. There's not really any other quests that I can do quickly and easily this episode, but I can make a start on one of them, okay? It's another quest where I'm probably the, the best equipped to do it. And that is the quest to get 10 netherite blocks. It's five and a half stacks of ancient debris, and I have a full beacon in my hardcore world. Well, I did, you, you know the story behind that, but anyway, I used to. So getting all of that ancient debris is not that difficult. Like 10 netherite blocks, that's nothing to me. So I'm fairly confident I can use my hardcore instincts and do that quest first. Plus I could get a bit of extra ancient debris and get some full netherite armor and good stuff like that. You know, it just makes me look kind of more kitted out. I don't know how close Mini got to getting them all. I mean, I guess you guys can check him out and see see how close he was to getting every food, but I, st I still feel kind of bad. But I've got to be like this now because it, it, he, he was one of the ones that tried to attack me when, he, when they tried to, him and Quiv 2v1 me. So you know what? He's not against going against me. I, this was necessary. I'm here to win, so that's what I'm going for. Now, let's have a little look. Anything good? Okay, it looks like it's already been looted, to be honest with me. I would have liked to travel back through the nether, but it would seem that the nether is just too far to uh, to get through. Do you know, I, I've, honestly, I'm paranoid, because I know that now that Clown is trying to trap me. I am paranoid to go through any nether portal, because I just feel like there's just going to be some trap on the end, you know? And... The only thing I can think of is if I if I somehow like throw an item through or something, it might trigger like any skulk sensors or something. I don't know. I need. I'm, I'm just very nervous to go through any nether portal. Minimook has completed the challenge of balanced diet. <laughs> Too late. Oh, that's even worse. Oh no, he was that close behind me. He must have been about five or ten minutes behind me. Oh wow, poor guy. Poor, poor guy. I wonder if Minnie will start an alliance with someone to take me out. They could, this could change the dynamic now that I've double-crossed him. Like, I haven't betrayed him in taking him out, but I've, I've, I've certainly betrayed him in, in taking a life that he could have got. But I need these lives more than him. Also, whilst I'm here, I feel like I should I should do something. I, I, I wouldn't mind. Here's what I want to do. I want to put the armor trims on my armor just because I think it'll look cool. Like, I have some redstone. So one, two, three, four. And I can make a smithing table. That's very nice indeed. So we can go ahead... Put the redstone on, put that, and I just need the armor to go with it. So I, I hope nobody ambushes me while I'm doing this. It would be like the worst time ever to uh, to get ambushed. There we go. Crafting a new look. Hey, yeah, the first one to do that. Fully changed up. Oh, yes. Look at me. I'm not entirely sure on how it looks, but it just looks like I've got blood on me or something. Anyway, that's, uh, that's that done. I wonder if Quiff's around here. I mean, it's not impossible, is it? He's not around by the looks of things, but could you imagine? He was just at his base and I could, <laughs> I could have taken him out. Like, I know it's only four minutes of PvP, but I, I'd get my hands dirty. I wouldn't mind a little bit of a little bit of uh, PvP. I, I, to be honest, I've completely forgotten to get the gunpowder I need to start this little mining thing. But at the same time, it doesn't matter too much because I need to go and drop things off my house. And that's the only portal I actually trust as well, the one over there. So that's kind of where I'm, I'm gonna be going. I trust it for now. I won't trust it next episode because, uh, well, well, let's be trust support. Let's go and trap it. This, I feel like clowns just going around laying traps everywhere. I'm gonna be very, very wary. Whoa, why so TNT in my base? <laughs> well, that's handy, I guess, because I um, I need extra TNT. I'll tell you what else I wanted to do, guys. My axolotl, I want to release in there. There you go. Got a little uh, little baby axolotl that lives in my house now. Yeah, that TNT will come in handy because I'm going to be using it. Um, <laughs> right, we, yeah, we just need to get a little bit more organized. Got a bit of sand in here, which is handy. Not quite enough sand for all the gunpowder that's going to be there, but a decent amount nonetheless. I've just found out Quiff is not in the nether. Clown is, because I just decided to sleep and see what would happen. Now, you see, this worries me, okay, because what is Clown up to in the nether? What is he doing there? I don't really need to sleep. It was nearly daytime. I mean, the phantoms were a little bit annoying. But yeah, I wanted to see which one of Clown and Quiff were in. And does he know that this right here is a portal that I know and trust? Well, not anymore. Just in case. I don't know. I don't know what Clown's up to. I'm going to throw an item through. Does an arrow go through? That could be cool. That should set off anything, right? 
Maybe. That could be a cool thing. And then I'm actually going to mine up the obsidian. This portal doesn't really need to be here. But with enough obsidian, I can make a new one. All right, that's, this is my plan. New portal. Keep using different portals. Never let them know your next move and all that good stuff. Okay, so I've got a, I've got a plan. We can make a new portal. Let's see how this is getting on, by the way. It's decent, you know. There's a, there's a good uh, seven or eight stacks of iron, which I can always use. And as I showed you earlier, I have a lot of gunpowder, so... I'm going to need a lot of sand to go with it and <laughs> many, many stacks. I could do the TNT mining method, actually. That, that's probably faster. Maybe I go to the back to the depth. All I'm doing is traveling around, but I just want to get a good head start on getting some ancient debris. You know, even if I spend half an hour, I, in about half an hour, I can probably get close to a stack. Yes, I need about five stacks to do the quest, but I think you'll agree that a stack of ancient debris is just a, a good start. So, crafting table down, start grabbing gunpowder, and start crafting TNT. Pretty nearly used all the gunpowder I have. I mean, I, well, there's a few stacks, but I've actually run out of sand, so I'll go back and mine more. It's not got me much that, you know. What's it got me? Two, three stacks of TNT so far. So technically, Clown could be in the end. He might not be in the nether, actually. I never even thought about that. But anyway, that's all the TNT I can craft. Not a huge amount, really. And now I'll boat away a little bit from the area. Make a new portal, which is safe. Very nice. And I made a tunnel last episode. I know pretty much where it is. And in theory, if I just dig on this level, I should come to it. In theory. I did. Okay. I, I, this is the one. Right. So, I'm going to go all the way to this end. Here we are. And I'm going to sparingly place it, okay? So, I'm going to place it like, I don't know, every four blocks. So, there's not going to be many chains. It's not going to be a super wide tunnel. But, it's going to at least, you know, be a long tunnel, <laughs> if nothing else. I've come to a thing of doing it every three blocks. I think that's a, that's a nice in-between, a nice medium. Turns out for the length of the tunnel, I actually had more than I needed, which is good. So, now we just shoot that with a flame and arrow. And we let it do its work. So a bit of spare TNT is nice. We'll see how much we get from not very much indeed, really. You can see the chain will break fairly easily because of the spacing, but I can just do that. It's not too bad of a size of tunnel, but if I get half a stack, I'll be happy. And already we've got some. That's good. It's a vein of three, which is a nice place to start. Oh, there's five altogether. This is what it's all about. I mean, like I say, I've got a, I've got a netherite beacon before, so... I'm, I'm, I might keep that, I, I'm, but I'm, so I'm used to doing stuff like this all the time. Already got to seven pieces. Oh, it's fantastic. And once I mine up this piece of ancient debris, I'll have 16. And that technically is a full set of netherite armor already, which is great because I've actually got about 250 blocks left of this tunnel to explore. Okay, I lied. It's actually only 170 blocks left. So maybe we're going to get to about 20 pieces, which isn't bad considering I didn't use that much TNT really in the grand scheme of things. But we'll see. It's looking like I might only get 20. No, no, okay, there's two more over here, which is good. So when you find those veins of three that it makes a difference, is that a vein of two over there again? Oh, it's just a vein of one. When it's just a single one, it's just annoying because like it's not really... It's almost... I mean, obviously it's good to find, but it's not worth your time. When you find a vein of three, it's a it's an exciting moment. And it helps you make progress a lot faster. I think there's just one here. Usually in the roof. When you see one in the roof, there's usually only one. That's, that's the end of the tunnel. Do I, do I just use it? I'll use it up. I only need to dig a 300 block tunnel. It's not too far, is it? Come to an area with loads of lava, so I'm just going to kind of place it down here. I think the tunnel should be long enough to get all the TNT down anyway. Made to the end. 13 to spare. I'll light it up and make a quick tunnel here for the other 13. No joy in this direction. Finally, it's revealed some. I thought I wasn't going to get any. All that TNT and I only got like an extra three piece. Oh, well, you know what? 22 ancient debris altogether. It's not that bad. Because in the grand scheme of things, I didn't really bring that much TNT. I probably need an entire shulker box worth of TNT, realistically. But for me, that's been great progress. Another successful episode. We're well on the way with the next quest as well, which is nice. I mean, 22 downing, 340 in total. Yeah, 318 left. Yeah, that's not the worst. But I do need to do some PvP at some point. I'm, can I get out of it? Fantastic. Yeah, I need to get, get PvP in. I've gone after Quiff a few times. I think I might do a serious charge after Quiff soon. Because I, I can't let him get away, you know. Too many times he's escaped. I, I think soon he's going to get an ambush and he is going to be defeated. I'm back at my house and Minnie is online right now and I, I feel kind of bad for what happened. So I'm, I'm going to go and chat to him and I'm going to make him an offer, okay? I'm going to make him a deal that's, that's at least going to make him feel a little bit better. Because he, he makes good videos, he works hard, so I want to, you know, I want to kind of soften the blow. And I need your guys' help, okay? I need your guys' help. We got a life out of this. I'm going to need you guys to subscribe, but there's going to be a twist and I'll, I'll tell him what it is when we get there, okay? Now I'm going to try and remember how to get into his base. That's always a difficult thing. And I've just flooded it as well. Minnie? I'm sorry. All right, I feel bad, but we're friend or foe. These things happen. Hello, SB. So, Hello. Oh, sorry, you caught me just in a... I'm, I'll just... I went, I'm not sad. You're not sad. No, okay. No. So I'm going to make it up to you, okay? You are very good at collecting food, as you've shown. Maybe not as... Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to punch you there. Not as good as, <laughs> as, as me. And I've, I need food as well, okay? I, I'm constantly searching for it. So, how about this? For every single person that comes from my channel and subscribes to you on this video, you 
have to get me one golden carrot? Because I know you've got loads of carrots. Does it sound? How does that sound? Well, I've got the carrots. And you've I've got, got the, the subscribers. And, and the gold. And the gold, yep. I, I say, you have yourself a deal. Fantastic. All right, guys. You know what you need to do. Subscribe to Mini.